So look where we're at. The boat showroom. It's still ripped off. It's still here. Yep. And we got a pin. We got a pin. <laughs> Signing our life away again. That means, yeah, we're signing our life away. We're upgrading to Skeeters. That one. <laughs> Skeeters. That one. Well, there she is. This is a Sportsman 1910. Powered by 150 SHO. Thank you. Thanks. All right, let's go. One hour later. Dude, I just heard a fish jump out here somewhere. Right. No, I don't talk to him. I just, I just don't launch it so far that it floats away. I'll just put it in the water so you can turn it off. That's fine. Oh Sure, everything looks good. <laughs> oh, dude, so quiet! So quiet, that is so quiet. That's quieter than the Honda. I'm pulling this up on the uh, yeah, the it's quiet. Right? See if it's pissing out. It's gonna be pissing out water, too. Yeah, it is. Oh. <laughs> Kill switch. <laughs> Kill switch. We don't have a boat yet. We're still running to all the little minor errors. <laughs> Kill switch does work, okay? We're, we're just testing out the kill switch. Just testing kill switch. <laughs> always have to have that on, you guys. Safety first. Always leave that Ooh, on. This thing turned on quick. That looks like brand new, right? Yeah. Hey, now I don't have to go pull the little thing in the back. Yeah, we don't have to pull a portal <laughs> Big deal. Big jump, you know. But is it spitting water? Spitting water. Red line? <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. I don't think you're far enough, Cone. You gotta go back more. Can you drag on these things? Go back more. I can drop it back a little. <clears throat> like another three feet. Very good. Yeah. And she's off. Maiden voyages. Did you say cricket? Or did you say black? Maiden voyage. She's just pretty good. Well, I mean, that guy's pretty fat, so he's in the front, so he's making it even. <laughs> we didn't even test out our trolley motor at the dealership. It wasn't working. Until we figured out that we didn't turn the back. Trolling motor? Oh! oh snap. Bye bye! <laughs> I'm out. We'll see you later. <laughs> I'm out. Make sure you make the payments. <laughs> make sure you don't skip payments.
Yeah, it's about uh, 60% full right now. It needs to be all the way full. All the way? Oh. Okay. Yeah, because we got to fill that VNT back up. Is that like a level sensor or something like that? Does it fire if that thing's too low? angle of the motor has nothing to do with this, right? There we go. Press it. All right, Colin, we Oh, get I it. see. Okay, so it's now coming again. Okay. Coming again. Try it. <laughs> yeah, so every time I crank it, it goes back down to halfway. Okay. Does that mean there's air in the system? It's going in. Okay. Yeah, trim, trim, trim the motor down all the way in the water. And turn the key to the on position. Yeah. Right. I just turned it back off. Y'all aren't going to have any issues. Just uh, that zip tie, it may not be 100% tight. It popped off of there. You know, uh, if you've got a zip tie or, you know, whenever you get off the water, just grab a zip tie and run a new zip tie on there and just make sure it's tight. What the heck? Do we have to use a zip tie or can I go get like a metal clip and put it on there? You, 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 can, you can use a metal hose clamp, but don't, don't over tighten it. Okay. Yeah. All right, guys. Holler if y'all need anything. Sorry about the inconvenience. Sorry y'all had issues, but, but Sorry. y'all got to get both that motor okay. solid. So. Well, I, I believe it's solid. The you know, stupid little you know, yeah, clip the kills the whole thing of it. <laughs> but let me, let me try to okay. crank it one more time while it's on the phone. Okay. Recap a little clip. Right. I'll tell you what happened. So we just bought this brand new boat, right? Brought it to the lake, put twenty work dollars worth of gas in it, and we just let it idle like that for ten minutes. And then boom, the, the engine shot off oh, by itself. You ran out of it. That's right. Yeah. So basically, the engine just died by itself. I've right, been trying to go. crank it for like fifteen minutes now. Nothing. And right. everybody in the world thinks Yamaha's are perfect, but. Supposedly, the factory, you don't know what the heck they're doing sometimes. Coley, I'm talking to you about that because you build crappy shit sometimes on Mondays, okay? Hey, it's, it's good stuff. <laughs> Made in America. Basically, there's this fuel line that goes into this thing, and there's another fuel line that comes out of it, and the fuel line popped off of it because the clip wasn't strong enough. The zip tie. The zip on. tie. So, a $15,000 motor dies because of a five cent zip tie. So. We're probably gonna have to go buy a metal zip tie or something, metal C clamp, or whatever. All right, so it's working again. Yeah, well, dude, even at total speed. Just let you guys know, every one of our boats always does this to us. Yep. I remember the John boy. I bought it brand new. Well, not brand new, but the motor was still brand new. He was trying to go fishing. Look out! And I told my other brother, let's fire this thing up in the backyard. Let's make sure it works. And I've already fired it up like 10 times already. It worked great. And then we tried to fire it up just so you could see it. And then something happened and the motor never started up for like an hour. We had to pull the spark plugs, the burn spark plugs, put them back in. And it finally worked. And then on his maiden voyage, we ran like four miles to this one point. And we killed it, the white bass. And then uh, this this motor for some reason is great and all, but this one little clip from the fuel line fell off, and when we're pumping the ball, it doesn't have enough suction on it, so now the fuel won't come to the primer ball to go to the fuel filter to go to the engine. So we were having problems, but now that she's working, she's gonna be uh, she's broke. Basically, she's broke engine right now. So we'll be pretty happy. We'll see like this boat fly like a million miles an hour now. You know, we're good. We're good. Maiden voyage and Maiden voyage. It's got the sequel weapon out already. <laughs> yep. Make sure you tie your shoelaces. Yep, where's I hear throwing A rigs or Maiden umbrella Maiden rigs. Man, look at this view. <laughs> I was like, 
Oh, I just pulled now. We're not going too far from the, the actual dock. Yo, there's already fish down there, bro. Straight down. Okay. 25. 25? That's my favorite, man. Right there's like rocks. That's a that's probably a fish, and that's a fish right there. A little, little dinky, dinky little, little fish right finder. there. This is like a $300 fish finder. It's got down imaging and cheese on it. We're just gonna idle for hours and hours, man. That's what we're supposed to do. What happened? You know, uh, I've been out for a while, so <laughs> <laughs> I didn't put it through here. <laughs> nice. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's been a minute for me and Captain Hook. Yeah, sure. Rusty, man, rusty. <laughs> Thinking about the kids. <laughs> yeah, I got all set up. What's going on? Feels good to be on a new boat, though. Oh, cool. see what happens, bro. Oh, I, I should have brought you to my uh, patrol bar, man. I think there's four people. Four, four, four Dude, guys. that's what we catch, bro. Dude, I'm going to land, yes. land the first catch right first here. First stop right here, guys? <laughs> What? Dang! Yo, this chopper is. Oh. It's got too many stripes. <laughs> That's a one sturdy ass. This is definitely a catch and release right here, you guys. Oh, uh, yeah, we don't eat catfish. Uh, you're gonna have to give it a kiss. Yo, <laughs> <laughs> no, get as away hell. from this. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead. That'd be a catch. Alright, guys, we're going home. It's dog trip. Even the amazing Captain Hook is giving up. Dad. Oh, there's a fish there! Oh my goodness, we're about to leave this. Uh, two. two. I see two. two. So you guys didn't troll long enough, that's all. It's, it's it is cold. Water temp is 39 degrees? Yeah. 39.8. And uh, 30 foot of water. When in the pond. It's not worth it, guys. Just stay home here for now. I'll give you the weather report and the fishing report for today. Weather report is cold and. Uh, the fishing port is uh it's not worth it coming out here. You know, having boat problems and all, you know what I'm But it's fun. Alright guys. That's the boat. Yep. What do you think about the boat so far? Yeah. It's good. <laughs> Better than be on shore. It's these. It's these. <laughs> it's kind of disappointment today. A little disappointment for sure. Captain Hall, what do you think about it? You're the only one that can give a real opinion because yeah, you're right not here. the boat's owner. Right here's where uh, like, uh, the owner that boat, okay. this you know, spot here, it in first. and you're where it's only uh, <laughs> twice. Then I can give my opinion. I'm the owner. Yo, thank you. These guys tell old, old stories that don't matter today.